Hey everybody, we're Dean of Handicapping, Thoroughbred Racing from the Spa, Saratoga Racecourse, Saratoga Springs, New York, on Monday afternoon, August the 1st, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle Naira Race of the Day. Let's take a look at the Race 8 feature this afternoon, folks, 4.45 p.m. Eastern Post Time for the Amsterdam Stakes, 6.5 furlong sprint on the dirt, grade 2, 3-year-olds, race for a stakes purse of $150,000. Contenders number two, Redeemed, number seven, Justin Phillip, number one, Arch Traveler, and number six, Traveling Man. If you folks are perhaps unfamiliar with the local New York State geography, Amsterdam is a neighboring town to Saratoga here in upstate New York. Here in the 18th renewal of this graded stakes event, number two, Redeemed, sit the board in each of his four career starts to date, including back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back power run wins in his last three adventures. Number seven, Justin Phillip, the overall speed leader, has hit the board in power run fashion in three straight, including a power run win his last time out. Jockey Ramon Dominguez and trainer Steve Asmussen send a postword for the Monday afternoon feature. They fit the board with 63% of their entries saddled as a team to date. Race 8 summary, number 2 redeemed, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 7 Justin Phillip, number 1 Arch Traveler, and number 6 Traveling Man, 2716 in the 8th from Saratoga, the $150,000 Grade 2 Amsterdam Stakes. Bonus long shots, Finger Lakes, here in upstate New York, race 9, number 7 Elaine's Pride, 6 to 1 of the morning line, drops in class by 2 units. The overall speed leader in this claiming field sprinting at her about today's distance of five and one half furlongs on the dirt. Prairie Meadows, race eight. Check out the 10 to 1 bomb, number six, Holly and Fur. The overall speed leader in this allowance field racing at the mile distance on the dirt. So from Saratoga, on a Monday afternoon as we close out another racing week here in New York, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over.